Hello and welcome back to the weekly news. How have you coped without us for a whole week? Well, don't worry, we're back now. Everything is going to be okay. Firstly, this week we were very excited to welcome Sarah Blackburn, our new children's and families worker to the team. We're already loving working with Sarah. Uh, she's a fabulous addition and we can't wait for you guys to get to know her. If you see her around, do make sure to say hi. Apart from you won't see her today, and she's already on holiday. It's all right for some. Coming up this week, the London Institute of Contemporary Christianity are hosting an online event in the evening of Tuesday the 12th of July. It's called Thriving in Teaching. This looks to be a great event for anyone involved in education to be inspired as to how they can make a difference on their front line. So if you're a teacher, don't miss out. Tickets are free and you can book online at licc.org.uk. Speaking of education, Hope Community School are looking to recruit some new learning support assistants. If you're passionate about children and looking for a term time job within a great school and community, this could be for you. Head to nextgenschools.org to apply or chat to Steve or Annabelle Wright for more details. Don't forget that the early bird ticket rate for wildfires ends at the end of July. A number of us from our community will be going along and it should be a great time. The event runs from the 29th to the 31st of May next year and we still have some free children's tickets available as well. So get in touch with us for the children's tickets, that's from age 0 to 18. But otherwise, head to the Wild Farms website to book in. Just a quick heads up that there will be no Forest Church in July or August. Instead, we will be having an all-age communion service on the 24th of July. And then from the 31st of July to the 28th of August, we will be having our summer Sundays. These are shorter family services with something for everyone. This year we will be looking at the I Ams of Jesus, uh, which is not, as I originally thought, anything to do with pet food. Different thing. Finally, another reminder looking ahead to the autumn term about the Leadership Transition Weekend on the 8th and 9th of October. This will be a chance to honour and thank Billy and Caroline for their leadership over the years as well as praying for Theo and Sarah as they take on the leadership from September. So make sure that the event is in your diary. That's it for this week, folks. But don't worry, we'll be back at the same time next week with all of your news needs. <laughs>